I have been. The worst kept secret in Memphis is finally public tonight. Amazon, the huge distribution company that seems to have its hands in just about everything these days, is opening another warehouse in Memphis. This one may be the biggest yet, almost 4 million square feet, and it'll be the first Amazon facility in town to use robots. Local 24 News reporter Mike Matthews takes a closer look. Amazon coming to town is the big deal that all cities search for. We got it. Amazon is like the pretty girl at the dance. Everybody wants Amazon. Everybody wants to brag about Amazon. Memphis can do it. We're not talking about anything like that huge plant planned for Nashville. But at 1,000 jobs and a $200 million investment, this warehouse will be nothing to sneeze at. You know, when a job is created and a, and a good paying job is created, a, a family's life has changed. So whenever we can recruit companies like Amazon and, and work with them to invest in our state and in our communities, then lives are changed in a positive way. In typical Amazon fashion, they broke ground for a warehouse that is already under construction. It's in Raleigh, right next to the Nike plant. And while there is public transportation out to Nike, all sides feel more will be needed. We're always partnering with the local government and uh, you know, Memphis and uh, Shelby County, and we'll be able to uh, work through uh, the partnership there so we can ensure there's, there's proper transportation for our associates. But the beauty of building right here is that there's thousands of associates that are within walking distance of the building. And this deal happened quickly. It was only three months ago when discussions began, and here it is January, and construction is already underway. We got the deal in October, and here they're already breaking ground in January. That's incredible speed, and that's a result of city staff really working to review the plans and approve the permits. What happens here could just be the beginning. This plant could expand, and they're certainly going to be trying to provide better public transportation out here. In Memphis, Mike Matthews, Local 24 News.